This is a diffusion in liquids, uh, okay? So diffusion in liquids, we use um, potassium permanganate. Uh, and potassium permanganate, the color is purple. Purple, okay? And then we use droppers to drop the potassium permanganate here. And then so after here, you write a few hours. Actually, not, not necessary, but it must be a few hours. Uh, usually 20 minutes, 30 minutes. Uh, you, can already, you can already see the results, eh? okay? So uh, 20 to 30 minutes. Eh? Okay, you can already see the results. And again, eh, the purple colors, potassium permanganate diffuse. It diffuse up to the whole water. Uh, actually, you can use anything which with color, liquids, eh, any liquids with color. Okay, but in SBM usually, eh, Okay, we there are a few uh, substances uh, which have color that you need to know. Copper sulfate is one of it. Okay, you can also use copper sulfate. Eh? You can use the copper sulfate solution, which is blue in color. And in this example, I show you potassium permanganate, and you need to memorize the colors of potassium permanganate. Yeah, in 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 exams, the they like to ask you the color of this substance. What's the colors of copper sulfate, and what's the colors of potassium permanganate? So make sure that you memorize it. Okay. Okay, diffusions in gas. We have uh, bromine water. At room temperature, bromine exists as uh, liquid. Uh, so we can see some liquid here. But bromine is a volatile gas. Volatile means that it can evaporate easily. Okay, so even though at room temperature, it's liquid, but uh, it can evaporate easily. So you will find that uh, if you put some liquids bromine here, it will evaporate and fill the gas jar. Okay, and then so on top of the gas jar, we have a cardboard here. Okay, to close it. After that, we put another gas jar on top of it. Uh, after that, we remove this cardboard. Uh, we remove this cardboard, and then a few minutes, just a few minutes, uh, we found that uh, both. The gas jars filled with this uh, brown color gas, uh, the bromine gas. So this shows that uh, the particles, uh, the bromine particles, has diffused into the upper gas jars. So these three experiments uh, is the uh, diffusions in solids, liquids, and gas. Uh, okay, you need to know this is the experiments of diffusions, and then you need to know the color of the substance that we use: uh, copper sulfate blue, potassium permanganate, purples. And then uh, bromine. Bromine, you can say uh, is brown color, and uh, you can also say it's orange color. Okay, so we usually we call it uh, reddish browns. Eh? The color is reddish brown.